right, let's take the last question on differentiation. All right, okay, let's take this question. This question says, find the derivation of the function y is equal to x raised to power x raised to power 2. Wow. I'm gonna do this, all right? Oh, it's very simple. Let's go. We are asked to find the derivative of the function y with respect to x. We have y is equal to x raised to power x raised to power 2. <laughs> all right, let's go. As usual, this is implicit function, and we're gonna carefully solve this, all right? Please pay attention to every step. Okay, now let's go. We're going to have, we're going to take the natural logarithm on both sides. So taking the natural logarithm on both sides, we're going to have in y is equal to in x raised to power x raised to power 2. Here, the exponent of x, let's bring it down. So the exponent of x is x raised to power 2. So we bring it down in front of in. So we're going to have in y is equal to x raised to power 2 in x. Okay, from here, we're going to differentiate this function with respect to x. So the differentiation of in y with respect to x is going to give us 1 all over y dy all over dx. On the other side, we have x squared in x. We are going to apply product rule here, okay? So we are going to have the differentiation of x squared is going to give us 2x, then multiply by in x. Then plus the differentiation of in x is going to give us 1 over x times x squared, okay? So we are having 1 all over y dy all over dx is equal to 2x in x plus x squared times 1 all over x okay now let's go we are going to have 1 all over y dy all over ds is equal to 2x in x plus x squared times 1 all over x is going to give us x squared all over x okay now let's go we have 1 all over y dy all over ds is equal to 2x in x plus x squared divided by x is going to give us x. 1x cancel up, 1x cancel down, remaining 1x up, all right? So that means we are going to have plus x. Now let's go. Here, we are going to make dy all over the x the subject. We are going to make dy all over the x the word, the subject. So in so doing, we are going to multiply both sides by y so that dy all over the x will stand alone, okay? So that means we are going to have dy all over dx is equal to y open bracket 2x in x plus x. Okay? But you, you remember that in, in the beginning, our function y is equal to x raised to power x raised to power 2. And here we are having y. That means we are going to replace y with the value x raised to power x raised to power 2 okay that means we are going to have dy all over dx is equal to in place of y we replace it with x raised to power x raised to power 2 open bracket 2x in x plus 2 all right thank you very much for watching we have come to the end of differentiation all right let's go into integration properly all right let's go